That's a lot of Forza games, huh? But... And that... Those are the only non-Forza games I have. Well, this is not considered a racing game. And I don't have my PS2 anymore. I'm gonna get a PS2 soon. Just to play that. But... Here's another one that joined the party. Project Gotham Racing 4. And yeah, you guys may know, if you guys live here in the States, yes, I got it through GameStop. And I know a lot of you guys say that these people should not be putting these discs in here. I don't know why they do not put these under cases though. But um, I always check uh, if, if, these, if the discs are on the sleeves, I always check if, this, if the disc is um, scratched, like heavily scratched or something. If it's just like hairline scratches, just like very tiny ones, they're not too bad because I have Forza Motorsport 2 uh, that's, that has a few uh, hairline scratches, but they're not, they weren't too bad. But this one right here, look at that. That is pretty darn clean. I don't see any scratches. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this on my Xbox 360 and see if it works. Okay, it's in the Xbox. Now I'm gonna go ahead and close it up and see if it'll work. I just, need, I just need to let it boot up and see if it works or not. Hmm, that sounds pl uh, pleasing. Oh, it usually has this. Come on. Yeah, so it's gonna upload. Oh, actually, not upload, download. So, um,. Looks like something is working. Yep, looks like it works. Yeah, everything is doing pretty good actually, so... Uh... Yeah, um, if you guys are wondering, this is actually the first Forza, uh, Forza. Uh, this is actually the first racing game that I ever uh, had on when I first got on Xbox 360. Alright guys, I'm going to go give this game a try for, and then I'll uh, come back to you guys uh, in the next video. I got Forza Motorsport 2 and Motorsport 3 videos to come up soon.